my good people we are giving you the complete and full detailed update about the Columbia flyover itself the flyover construction like i said is a 18 months project started last year and i bet you these guys are going to meet up this target of uh, this year is going to round up 18 months this year around probably november december so we hope to see a completed flyover at a Wulobia around that period when we move around or when we are done moving around you understand and you will confirm that these guys are going to meet up with that target of uh, completion i told you guys that uh, a whole new city is being built between a Kulobia, a Sofia axis that is connecting Oka, the capital city as uh, the dualization will soon commence you know by this same company added with guild so you see it that uh, the infrastructure here is um, is going to open up this place you know faster than what you expect being that uh, Isofia, the whole road in Isofia is now constructed uh, coupled with the Colombia too majority of the roads in the Colombia is under construction or if not concluded with the flyover and the uh, modern bus terminal at uh, Colombia here I think this is a new whole city that is under construction well kudos to the governor and this is a you know a good thing that is coming to Anambra state but uh, you know the government should not forget that uh, some other areas too need uh, such reconstruction places like uh, Newe that has been under you know neglect no some projects are going on there but now we need some you know kind of flyover to connect well and i hope uh, that um, there is plans for Newe, even though we've heard it that uh, former gruto Newe will be dualized very soon and uh, there is hope to have uh, a flyover at that uh, Newe junction moving down to Newe, something like this is going to help a lot along that place in fact what is happening that side is uh, terrible you know, when uh, the traffic uh, started building up along that axis it becomes a different thing well that slab you just saw now is that slab up there you know is going to be placed on top of this uh, beam so the slab will carry the load of the road the load of the road itself so the road is going to be on top of the slab that is the way it is well um, um talking about the flyover at the club you can see just some remaining parts a little part of the beam that is holding this place now they will start hanging the beams and uh, the major work is being concluded somehow the foundation laying the pillars are there is just to start hanging and uh, you know some joinings that's what is remaining last time we came here we did not see any single beam that was casted though they were in the process of uh, you know casting it but they've not casted any so now so many have been casted and uh, they were done according to where they will be placed so viewers uh, if you have not subscribed to the live channel please click on the subscription button notification bell like this video and don't forget to share it 
because others long to see updates just like uh, you are seeing it right now don't keep it to yourself that is the only thing you can do for others share this video on social medias other platforms and uh, don't keep it to yourself by sharing it you encourage us to do more and uh, you know you help others to see the current updates of the happenings in and in Anambra states thank you So you can see this is uh, towards the end of uh, the flyover at, uh, that's moving to Oga side and uh, honestly speaking the work is going on as expected yes you can confirm it that uh, you know, there is significant progress concerning what we are seeing on ground well we wait to see the completion of the flyover no many confirm that the flyover is a single lane flyover of feature uh, that is where i have a little issue you know anything we are doing now in anambra state we should be doing it for the future not forgetting the fact that uh, the flyover construction and uh, other construction happening here is a welcomed development that is going to bring a lot of uh, upliftment to Anambra and the uh, people of uh, Kulopia and the Sofia exist you know a uh, significant benefit to them so but I want to believe that um, this is a starting point because no, that is the major belief and uh, talk of our people. Charity begins at home. And you can see where the charity is starting at home and uh, is going to you know, spread to other places. Yes, uh, other places are begging for this type of uh, flyover construction because of what people are passing through at that point. I've mentioned the uh, Nobi, another place that is very bad is uh, Oyagu Junction, Bagana. Oyagu is in a terrible state that uh, if you are choked up there, in fact, forget where you are going. So that place needs something like this, you know, to control traffic on that place. Why these things are very important is that Anambra is a commercial state and people do their business from one point to the other. It's not everybody that is living in Onicha or Onewe or Oka. You know, people stay in between places like that, Abagana, Omonachi, all those exist. People stay there and go for their businesses in Onicha or Oka because of the proximity is very close so all these places needs to be in top condition it's assumed that the whole place is, is uh, becoming a city so we need a proper connection like this in an Anambra state to avoid you know lack of um, or loss of manpower or man hour loss of man hour in 
doing business on daily basis to avoid trapping on a traffic jam and uh, you know your time will be wasted that is what i'm saying and uh, you know this part of the world we don't like waste of our time because you know, people at every point are chasing one thing or something is chasing them that is the thing well uh, we are still at a uh, lot of flyover and um, i see the level of work that is going on here you know, just like play like play they are about you know uh, concluding about 60 to 70 percent of the road construction everything you see here has its own job and uh, there's a reason for that you see this uh, uh, pillar pillars that tie rapper you know the pillars tied rapper that thing has its own job that rapper you are saying has its own job the job of it is that you know they are going to wet the the material the wrapper once they wet it is going to provide additional strength to the pillar is equivalent like uh, pouring water on the pillar but this one will help it to you know soak more water and uh, get it in top good shape Yes, we are still moving along that um, Ekulobia major flyover construction. This one is not about adjoining roads or any other thing. This is the flyover itself. As we are taking a detailed look of the job so far on the flyover construction. Well, if you see a very good cement mixture, nobody will tell you, you know. Though this one is a flyover, the mixture is quite different from uh, every other one. But um, when it comes to construction of any sorts of concrete work, the mixture is not supposed to be far much different from uh, you know, um, every other mixture you see some people some of the contractors they are cement concrete mixtures if you touch it it will become powderish even to the point that you see some sand will be moving out from the concrete work that shows that uh, it is very very below standard <laughs> So, viewers, uh, you have seen it, and um, I'm still Chinedu, your presenter. Let me allow you to finish up the good and the other side of this flyover construction at uh, Ecolobia in Anambra State of Nigeria. Thank you for coming around. I leave you now to finish the other parts of this flyover construction. Thank you.